Hey guys, how we doing? Welcome back to Durango Wildlands. Sorry guys, it's been a bit, feels like it's been a lifetime since I've jumped into the game and spoken to you guys, but we're back. So we are actually going to go through the patch notes that came out uh, yesterday. So uh, June 19th to be exact, the time of this posting when this came out was about 12 hours ago, my time. Um, so yeah, so it's been half a day. Uh, since the notes came out, so I wanted to sort of take you guys through it if you guys haven't seen it already So hopefully this would be of some use and value. So before we get under the way uh, Make sure you guys hit the like button if you do enjoy the Durango videos um, Really helps me out with that one there if you guys are new make sure you hit the subscribe button notification bell all that sort of good stuff But that out of the way, let's get right into it. So with the patch notes here Key features from what they're saying here is meet the cutest but ambitious uh, Brachiosaurus. Okay. And build a personal storage in your tamed island. Okay. So they're key features, but pretty much does not elaborate on that. So hopefully that will um, pretty much uh, hopefully self elaborate as we sort of get onto the patch notes. So far, what I'm doing is I'm just going <clears> to <throat> just go into the uh, the old uh, mission um, I might even just go out a little bit further to the uh, uh, Further out just to sort of explore the island as well anyway <clears throat> So the event there is a die event and cooking event now. This will be held in civilized islands uh, So pretty much from now at the time of you guys possibly watching this till the um, the end of uh, July. So it's gonna be a lengthy time by the looks of things. Uh, please note that you can only participate in these events in civilized islands. So you can't do that in uncivilized, unfortunately. So no go for that one. Now, civilized die event only um, in civilized islands, you can install a die workbench and dying bench. Just see how we're going with that. Perfect and Use crayons on the die uh, workbench to create a special die. Okay. So characters have an effect on the dying items. Uh, item levels may decrease depending on the character level when dying. All right, fair enough. Now with that, uh, sorry, I'm just trying to handle this on two different screens here. So give me some patience, guys. Uh, items with this decrease in level cannot be recovered or level up, just so you know. Uh, civilized island cooking event. Install a kitchen which can only be installed in a civilized island. Then cook fried diner eggs, bacon and uh, corn salad. There is a house party event. Okay, we'll just get this crate up. Uh, house party event has come to an end, sorry. Um, now the carnation seeds and white rose seeds can no longer be planted. Carnation cake, rose, steak, white rose, fence, and carnation fence can no longer be crafted. So you can no longer request um, event seeds through the organization's support. It's July, in brackets, soon a new month calls for a new um, attendance uh, check. Okay. There is a shop update as well. Okay, so we're nearly at the, um, at the first mission that I'm going to do here. Okay, as I'm just sort of uh, plodding along here. So, yeah, so shop update, raincoat, uh, decorative gear package can now be purchased. Um, so that's going to be the first thing that's going to be able to be done. And I'm just going to double check first before we get into that. Acquire a... Okay. So we're just going to have to take down an Oviraptor. Not a problem. So... You, sir, let's take you down. Okay, and this should be the final blow. Perfect. Do you have a feather for me? No, you do not, but you do have meat, and I'm going to take that meat. Anyway, so meet the Bracho Buddy, your friendly dinosaur. Get an advanced support package, reduces time for all actions and much more. Fast level 55 package. And basically... Oops. Oh, you know what? I'm going to get onto you guys later because that will get me to the next warp island. Uh, yes, so gear collection slots can now also be um, purchased for an unlimited period of time. Oh, that was quick. No feathers though, unfortunately. 
Um, if you already have the gear slot with the expiration date purchase, you can purchase the new item um, after the original item expires. Personal storage um, can now be purchased. It can only be installed in the Tame Islands. And the map reveal voucher has been introduced. So I find this a little bit interesting. If you guys are really wanting to discover or have the full discovery of the island before you sort of get into it, naturally you're going to have to pay for it as well. Um, which I've noticed before so you can use them only in the unstable islands Please visit the in-game shop in order to see the price sales duration and detail functions of the packages items mentioned above So that would be for that unfortunately no success so far for obtaining a feather which is really annoying Hopefully you might have a feather for me my friend Okay. Anyway, I'll just let you go auto for now now the world slash uh, climate, sorry, the availability, oh there we go, feather, perfect. Uh, distribution of metals, gems have been changed uh, in the new level 60 islands, small islands in each uh, archipelago uh, do not provide metals and gems, tundra climates no longer contain copper, zinc or, but rather tin ores and sapphires, tin and... Silver ores can no longer be found in tropical climates, whereas iron ores will be um, prevalent in these areas. Uh, God, you can now acquire gold ores and rubies, and more rubies. I think that might be gold. Or gold. I don't know. Anyway, uh, effect sounds will no, oh, sorry, will not be more fitting depending on your location near rivers, lakes, and the sea. Okay, so that's that. So we've just done the first mission there. I'm going to run down to the committee. So while I do that, mission quests. Okay, so, oop, I don't know why I went there, but that's okay. Okay, so the requirement for farming expert level three has been changed. Flawless f uh, farming 15 times, farming at 10 times. T-stone rewards have increased for cooking expert, farming expert, and processing expert one and two. Uh, let's just go over this and you can complete the magazine um, power of technology oh, still halfway there um, task without having to get the code snippets from completing the weekly task acquiring code snippets through all other means will allow you to complete the above task uh, descriptions of milestones tasks have been changed uh, sorry have changed to be clearer okay now, interface, the effect buff icons in the event package, uh, where is it, hang on, uh, have been displayed on the top left corner and can now, be dis uh, can now display six in one row, okay, so a little bit more efficiency on that one. And finally, I think we're towards the end here, the bug fixes, so the character issues with the character level now was displayed as in one of certain cases have now been fixed. Um, Item crafting, new item information window for decorative gear no longer displays the uh, items that can uh, be created with them. You can now dye autumn glasses acquired through the special express uh, cargo with the construction. Um, now this basically construction, uh, the screen no longer dims when you enter the barracks. Fix the bug with the sensational buildings, oh sorry, sectional buildings I should say. Uh, were invisible under certain conditions. Animal Bumblebee um, Phenokinos, if I've pronounced that correctly, I probably haven't. Uh, lead on me in uh, uh, quote-unquote uh, quote, quote, uh, quotations. Can now be used properly during combat. Breaking a bond with an animal after using a special behavior will no longer affect the stats of the animal in the cage. And finally moved over to the committee here. Okay, so I'm going to have to take down a Stegosaurus. So let's see how we do with that. <laughs> anyway, I'm going to finish off this anyway. So uh, mission task, fix, fix the issue in which certain quests were not being completed. Uh, for some pioneers, uh, please complete the task once more in order to proceed. Uh, achievements slash tasks that require you to level up to a certain point will be completed once you level up. And now just other as a generic, the finger slash hand icon displayed in the safe house number nine is now displayed properly. The limit for the max number of purchases for code snippets are 15. 
And then finally, the known issues display previews for the dyeing autumn glasses are not being displayed properly. The actual dye process is functioning as intended. Inside the barracks um, is not being displayed when the pioneers go through them. The tasks for farming expert three, three sorry, cannot be completed currently. Previews for the dyeing of autumn glasses is not dis being displayed properly. The actual dyeing plus, okay, well that's just a, a copy and paste. And my guy's fallen asleep as I'm talking, so he's actually bored of me talking here. It's alright, we're going to wake you up in a sec, buddy. Uh, bugs under review result is not being exposed through the previous menu screen if you modify floor. Anyway, with that out of the way, that's pretty much everything that we sort of have to go through with that one there. Which is fair enough. Um, so yeah, a few things that have sort of gone through. Um, so quite the update by the looks of things. Um, so a couple of events um, that are coming through which I'm sure you guys are more than interested in. And hopefully that will go through, um, you know, uh, through the rest of the next month. And you guys will have enough time to pretty much um, get yourselves involved in that as well. So, yeah, participate, guys. I think that that'll be a good thing for you guys to do, uh, especially with your clan mates as well. Why not? Um, as we take down this Stegosaurus, we took him right out and acquire his meat. And I'll just do that. And I might just take his leather. And perfect. Now the fact, I don't think I can because I need butchering level 40 and intestines, same deal maybe, yeah. Take the ribs, why not? So yeah, so they're the patch notes for the new update. Hopefully you guys actually enjoyed a patch note video uh, from myself. Um, it's a little bit something different. Um, to what I normally have uh, produced with all of my current Durango videos. Hopefully you guys enjoyed that one. Let me know in the comments what you guys thought about that. Um, sort of tried my best, tried to multitask, so hopefully you guys weren't too upset about, you know, sort of half doing that and trying to sort of play the game at the same time in terms of gameplay. But, you know, you can only try your best with what you've got. I mean, the game does sort of require your more full attention. Um, it's probably the right thing to sort of say. Anyway, as we sort of go on and we sort of drop off some of our bits and pieces. Uh, so let's fill that automatically. Add. Cool. And this is a committee. Getting closer to uh, level 44, which is always a good thing. But I think we're going to leave it here today. Just a brief one from me, guys. Hopefully you guys enjoyed that. Um, something different. Anyway, go ahead and hit, hit that like button. Make sure you do that. It really helps me, the channel, the video out as well. So it's a win-win. If you take two seconds there, please do that. That would be much appreciated if you guys enjoyed the video. Um, also, by hitting the like button, if you guys are new, also subscribe. Hit the notification bell, all that sort of good stuff. Comment down below, guys. Um, let me know what you want me to do do in the next video actually that's something that i'm interested in wanting to hear from you guys um you know and i'll go and see you know if i'm capable of doing certain things um because i know the game's obviously heavily intensified with certain skills attributes things like that but yeah i want to hear from you guys now uh let me know uh what i could do for you guys in the next video if there's something of interest a topic of interest uh let me know and i'll see if we can make that happen Anyway, take it easy and I'll catch you next time.